You've been asking for it, and now it's here. The Hubitat Elevation Apple HomeKit integration. Let's dive in. If you are an Apple user like me, this Apple HomeKit integration is a very exciting development. With this integration, you can bridge the Zigbee and Z-Wave bulbs, switches, and sensors from your Hubitat system into Apple HomeKit. This means that you can see and control your Hubitat devices with the Apple Home app, you can use that app as your dashboard, and you can command and control Hubitat devices and scenes using Siri. To use Apple HomeKit, you obviously have to be in the Apple ecosystem. Now, you can use the Apple Home app on your iPhone without having a dedicated HomeKit hub, but it is pretty limited in its capabilities. If you really want to make this a part of your automated home, you should invest in a HomeKit hub. And that is either an Apple HomePod or an Apple TV. An Apple iPad can also be used as a hub, but trust me, it's slow. It's always got to be plugged in. It, it's a bad experience. So just get a HomePod or an Apple TV and you'll be a lot happier. So assuming you have that taken care of, let's get your integration set up in your Hubitat Elevation Hub. I suggest doing this on your computer or something other than your iPhone so you can use your iPhone to scan a QR code at a later step. So go into your hub, go to the apps, and we're gonna load an app. Then select the Apple HomeKit integration. When you get into the app, you'll see all of the devices you can bridge into Apple HomeKit. Select the ones you want. This helpful pop-up tells you what to do in the Apple Home app, but we'll show you that next. After you choose the devices you want to connect, we'll use the QR code to bridge it into our Apple Home app on our iPhone. Just be aware that Apple puts some restrictions on the devices that can be brought into HomeKit via bridge, such as non-HomeKit locks and Wi-Fi devices. If you have incompatible devices, they will be shown here. Okay, so we're gonna move on to the Apple side of things here. We're gonna open up the Apple Home app in our iPhone. We're going to hit the plus button here to add an accessory. And then we're gonna scan the QR code right here to add our bridge. Now it's gonna give you this warning right here um, that will go away once we are certified, so you may or may not see it, but we're gonna hit add anyway. And now it's gonna go through and connect our bridge. Okay, so our bridge has now been found. We gotta put it in a room. We're gonna put it in our office here. So we're gonna create a new room. Put it in the office. And that's our bridge right there. So we'll continue with that. And it has successfully been added. At this point, it is gonna go through all of the devices you chose to add, ask you to confirm their name, add them to a room, and choose the type of devices you want them to display as. You can skip this or do it later if you want, but we'll zip through it using the magic of YouTube. Once we're done, we are left with this nice looking dashboard that includes all of the devices we just added, along with any other device you may have already connected directly to your HomeKit home. The Hubitat Elevation and Apple HomeKit communicate very seamlessly with one another, so let's just look at this IKEA light right here. We turn it on, almost immediately it turns on right there. We turn it off, and immediately same thing there. So let's, even if we do it here, we turn it on there, You'll see it shows up right there. Same thing right there. Turns off almost immediately. So it's very slick and it just shows how well Hubitat Elevation and Apple HomeKit can work together to elevate your home. So that's it for getting your Hubitat Elevation Hub connected to HomeKit. Remember, Hubitat is also compatible with Amazon Alexa and Google Home. So no matter what voice assistant you prefer, we've got you covered. For more help using Apple HomeKit, visit our online community at community.hubitat.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe for this video so we can keep these things coming. Till next time, thanks for watching, and thanks as always for elevating your environment with Hovitat Elevation.